Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if your mouse pointer or mouse cursor has disappeared or is not working properly on your Windows 10, Windows 11, or Microsoft Surface device. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in device manager, best match, or come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. Double click on the mice and other pointing devices section, and then right click on the mouse entry in here, and select update driver. Select browse my computer for drivers, and then select, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select the one that's for the compliant mouse, and then select next. And then once that is done, go ahead and select close. Close out of here. If you're still having a problem, something else we can try as well. If you open up the search menu and type in Bluetooth and, and then one of the best results should say Bluetooth and other devices settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side here, you want to scroll down underneath related settings and select where it says more devices and printer settings. Right click on the computer mouse and select mouse settings. Select the pointer options tab and where it says display pointer trails, uncheck that option as well as automatically move pointer to the default button in a dialog box. Make sure both of these are turned off and also check mark where it says hide pointer while typing. If you do not want to hide the pointer when typing, you can uncheck that option. That could be a reason possibly why you're on this tutorial is that for some reason it's turned back on. However, the default selection is in the on position, so just keep that in mind. Select apply and OK if you have to make any changes there. You should restart your computer. And hopefully at this point, your issues should have been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.